Bitcoin BTC and Ethereum, the two largest cryptocurrencies by a considerable margin, boast hundreds of millions of users around the world after a huge price explosion in recent years. Subscribe now to Forbes Crypto Asset and Blockchain Advisor and successfully navigate the volatile Bitcoin and crypto market. The Bitcoin price soared to almost $70.000 oh, 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 per Bitcoin late last year, up from under $10.00 oh, 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 two years ago, while the Ethereum price has seen a similar rise. Both are down by around 40% from their all-time highs, however. Now, Brian Armstrong, the chief executive of major Bitcoin and crypto exchange Coinbase, has predicted there will be a massive influx of crypto users in the coming decade, forecasting 1 billion people will have used crypto by 2032. Want to stay ahead of the market and understand the latest crypto news? Sign up now for the free Crypto Codex, a daily newsletter for crypto investors and the crypto curious. My guess is that in 10 to 20 years, we'll see a substantial portion of GDP happening in the crypto economy, said Armstrong, speaking at the Milken Institute Global Conference this week in comments first. Coinbase, based in San Francisco, currently has almost 90 million verified users across 100 countries. The crypto economy has grown rapidly over the last few years as businesses and services spring up around Bitcoin, Ethereum and other cryptocurrencies. Decentralized Finance, DeFi, the idea that crypto technology can replace lenders and insurers, and blockchain-based digital collectibles known as non-fungible tokens, NFTs, have both become multi-billion dollar markets in just a couple of years. Some of the world's largest technology companies, including Facebook's parent Meta and Elon Musk's electric car company Tesla TSLA, have begun adopting crypto. Meta, under Chief Executive Mark Zuckerberg, is looking to expand into the so-called metaverse digital world where NFTs are expected to play a significant role. Tesla has added Bitcoin to its corporate balance sheet and has begun experimenting with crypto payments. Financial giants on Wall Street have also slowly started to roll out crypto services to clients. Speaking alongside Armstrong, ARK Investment Management's chief executive, Kathy Wood, one of the biggest backers of Web3, a name for the crypto and blockchain-based next generation of the internet that some think could succeed the current Silicon Valley-centric model, warned financial companies not T. So they have to take it seriously, or else they are going to be hollowed out.